My name is Angie and I'm the campus director for Minnesota School of Cosmetology. In terms of safety, sanitation, infection control, uh, any type of cleanliness, those are already routines that were built into our day-to-day -day life. When COVID happened, we had to look at what those procedures were not modify them, but actually multiply them. So not only are we doing our safety and sanitation that we would typically do at the start of the day, at the end of the day, but we're also implementing a midday and also in between clients. I think that with COVID and some of the changes we needed to make, we're more along the lines of what had come out from like the Minnesota Department of Health and um, the CDC. So mask wearing was something that we hadn't experienced in the past. Um, additional hand sanitizer. Hand washing is a requirement for all of our programs, so we have multiple hand washing sinks throughout the campus. That wasn't something that was different for us at all. The distancing part, well, a tape measure and some blue tape, and we also purchased some floor stickers to identify where that six feet is um, for social distancing. On the salon floor, we took it a step farther and we made sure that every other station was not being used. So they're all, they've all been then marked off um, as well as shampoo bowls and, and our pedicure chairs. Yes, they were thrilled. We actually had almost a 90% return of our students on the first day. So they were extremely excited about being back. And I think that part of that is, is that they miss each other. They miss each other, they miss the instructors. And I know they miss the clients. So, you know, I think that they're willing to do what they need to do so that we can all be back together and do it safely. To learn more, visit msccollege.edu.